and welcome to today's hairstyling for idiots. <laughs> Megan's from the future. She's today's guest host, Idiot. We're teaching her how to style hair. From the 70s, because in the 70s, the hairstyles will come back way in the future. Mm -hmm. Alright, first you need to get paper and put it on a table so it makes less of a mess. Preferably a driving book so then you can multitask and learn to cut hair and drive at the same time. And then, you need to separate the hair. Be careful not to touch the speaker. That is a very sensitive spot on dolls. Mm -hmm. And if you get hair in there, it'll mess up their talking so much. It'll sound like... Alright. Now first, so you have to... You have a bigger half. Now it's better. First, what you have to do is open your scissors. Okay, now we're ready to cut some hair. Okay, whatever suits your fancy, Megan. Oh, I can't get this hair tie out. <laughs> That's a good solution. She wants lots of layers. <laughs> Emily, what do you do if the scissors don't go through? You chop harder. Here we go. I got hair now. You future people are weird. Well, at least we can tell the difference of our sides. I'll get the bath. No! That's my hair. Mm. Ah, give your person layers or something, or buzz it at the top. <laughs> give her a mullet. <laughs> okay. I heard they're coming back in the future. Party in the front, or I mean business in the front, and party in the back. Mm-hmm. See how it's keeping nice and clean because we put this paper down? It's very good. <laughs> now let's shake her out. <laughs> Alright. Your cleaner janitors are going to have a hard time cleaning this up because it's going to be so clean. And they're not going to know where to clean. I know. It's not like they have handy robots to come in and clean for them. Do they have that in the future? Yes. Now you just cut through the knots. Like this. If there's a knot there, you just cut through it. And then it's not a problem anymore. I'm starting to make the mullet shape. That's very good. She already has some highlights, so we have to be very gentle with her hair. I think we just gave her brain damage. But there's a cure for that in the future. We don't want it back here. Now it's out of the way. It's a very good idea to cut with your eyes closed. <laughs> because then, you get very good style. And it's, it turns out very nice usually. <gasps> Mine is so much better! I know! Isn't it wonderful? <laughs> That's why we cut with our eyes closed. But we usually don't tell our customers because it makes them a little nervous sometimes. In the future, we don't need to tell anybody anything. They already know. Ooh! Future sounds like a very daring place.
back. As you can see here, we have the finished product. Some nights, she likes to be a little bit of a tomboy, and other nights, she likes to be a girly girl. The street demands both at some times, mm -hmm. so we split it down the middle. And we gave her a boy style, nice and spiked and coloring. It's very nice. Done by Megan. And on my side, it's very girly and very angled and layered and stuff. And I gave her some streaks. And we gave her a nice bangs, some side bangs. This is a very typical future cut right here. Mm -hmm. It's very nice. Very nice, very nice. This is what everyone will be wearing. Very stylish.